change this one setting right now in order to boost FPS and fix FPS drops inside of the Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 2. Hey everyone, it's Rek here and welcome back to a brand new video and today I'm gonna be showing you guys a simple and easy method that anyone can use in order to boost their FPS, fix FPS drops, any lags or stutters and get more performance on low-end PCs in the Fortnite Chapter 4 Season 2. But before jumping into the video, just make sure to leave a quick like on the video so that it can reach more people and help them as well. And also make sure to hit the subscribe button and without any further ado, let's dive straight into today's video. So the method that we are going to be going ahead and using is using the stretch resolutions. Now using a stretch resolution is a very simple way to boost FPS and even lower the FPS drops or stutters that you might be experiencing in your game. I will also be suggesting you guys some of the best stretch resolutions available out there and they will be in the description down below. And I'm going to be going ahead and showing you guys the easiest method to apply the stretch resolution. All you need to do is go down into the description of this video and click on the link for my website it will take you to my post and then just go ahead and click the download button there which should take you to this web page right here once you're here what you need to do is just click on the alphas 1.2.1x64.exe and it should be downloaded once you have downloaded this app all you need to do is right click on it and run it as administrator and inside of here there are a couple of things that you need to change first is the width and the height of the resolution so we are going to be going ahead and using a stretch resolution so i'm going to go ahead and put in a stretch resolution so for me i'm going to go ahead and put in 1720 by 1080 and this is going to be the stretch resolution that i recommend most of you guys to use as well i will also be leaving other stretch resolution recommendations for low-end pcs as well as medium and high-end pcs over on my website so yeah make sure to go ahead and read that the link can be found in the description alongside the post where you will go ahead and download this tool so once you have selected your stretch resolution from that list go ahead and change your fps limit so in my case i consistently get around 200 fps so i'm gonna go ahead and put in 200 but if you guys are getting like let's say 100 fps on average then go ahead and put in 100 if you get 300 fps on average then go ahead and put in 300 but just make sure that you put in the number that you get consistently otherwise you will experience a lot of fps drops for the window mode it should always be on full screen and windowed full screen and windowed are not even in debate other than that just make sure that the read only box is checked hit apply hit ok now you can close out of this and launch your game and that's basically it you are now done you should experience much better fps and overall performance inside of the game just make sure to choose a stretch resolution that fits your needs but yeah that will be it for this video if this video helps you in any way shape or form then make sure to leave a like down below so that it can reach more people and help them as well and make sure to hit the subscribe button along with the notification bell so that you get notified whenever i upload a brand new video but with that i'll see you in the next one until then stay awesome